So our host this week is Francis with Golf and Chick Nails. Definitely check out all of the wonderful artists that decided to join on the collaboration this week. I absolutely love their manis and how they incorporated a theme, which was, uh, what was the theme? Um, complimentary colors was the theme for this week's challenge. And uh, Francis helped us out with a color wheel. So I'm gonna include the color wheel so you guys can see what I'm talking about. So here is the color wheel and you just basically pick a color and right across from that is going to be the complementary color. Now I picked a difficult color because it was green with pink shimmer. So I looked at the wheel and I saw that green kind of went well with pink and that's how I came out with my design. So stay tuned and check it out. Hi guys, thank you for tuning in to a wonderful collab. Don't forget to check out the other ladies that participated in this collab. And I definitely want to thank the host of the collab. Uh, quickly, this is what I have on my nails um, it is hopefully you can see it okay because I can't see a thing that I'm doing it is enchanted polish in moon lagoon and is this absolutely stunning dark green and I hope this light is catching it it is a dark green with pink shimmer Oh, it is so pretty. I wish I had a matte top coat because the matte top coat would definitely make the um, shimmer stand out more, but I don't. Here it is on the bottle. Okay. So, okay, you can, guys, you can see it right there. Look at that pretty pink shimmer. I love this polish. I do not have anything like it so pretty okay so moving on um on my nails i have the color i have some liquid latex i am going to be using my body powder that i keep in this little jar with this cap i would ideally recommend for you to take off the cap before you put on the liquid latex um i always forget so then you want to take a little brush and you guys have seen me do this a lot of times so I'm just gonna do one nail for you guys to see so I am a klutz so I am going to be doing all the sides then once I am finished I take a different brush and I just wipe off the excess I'm going to do that to the rest of the nails. Now, if you guys remember, I fell in love with this plate. This is a Moira's Catwalk number 30. And it's just absolutely gorgeous. Look at the details on all of these images here. Super, super, super pretty. Stunning, just all of them are stunning. Super pretty images. But anyway, I decided that I wanted to use this corner image with the bow. I really want a lot of the base color to show, but I thought the bow was absolutely adorable. So that's what I'm going to be using. So stay tuned if you want to see my design. So here is what I have so far. I really, really, really like how this is coming out. It came out super cute. So, um, and there's a thumb if you want to see it. I really like how these two colors play together. Super pretty. And the stamping polish is Girly Bits in Coral Reef. Hopefully you guys can see that. So... I am using my generic big clear stamper. Heads up when you guys are doing the um, I get 
I'm not trying to flip you. I figured this is the biggest nail or the widest nail that I have on this hand. But anyway, <clears throat> when you guys are stamping and you're using baby powder, make sure that you get all the residue off of your stamper for your next pickup because the baby powder or whatever powder that you use is going to leave a film on the stamper head. So, we go here, we put the polish because my nails are on the slim side but um, I don't have to put much on there. Pick it up. Beautiful pickup as you can see right there. And let's line it up. Okay, maybe not so beautiful pickup. It's so hard when I'm trying to um at you guys so I can't see myself through the camera. And it's a lot to it's a lot to do and try to get into frame and do it right. So let's try that again. Of course, you know, the one that I have to do on camera and do the pickup is the one that doesn't come out as pretty. But that came out pretty nice. Awesome pickup. Very, very pretty pickup. Now, I do have oily bonder on my nails. So, I can take my time with the placement. But my nails curve so much. Now, I did want this bow in the middle. And hopefully you guys can see that. I did want this bow in the middle of the nail. And I'm sorry for the glare. But there it is. Now, how pretty is that? Because of the way my natural nails curve, there are some spots that I didn't get perfectly, but I'm okay with that. So uh, let me clean up and I'll be right back. So here you have it guys. I love how this mani turned out. Super, super, super pretty. I love the complementary colors. It is green with the pink shift. Look at how cute those came out. Um, I accidentally, um, nicked my pointer finger right there when I was putting the cuticle oil, but that's okay. I really love the way they came out. Super pretty colors. Alright guys, thank you for watching. Please don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. And don't forget to check out the other wonderful ladies that joined in the collab. See you later. Bye.